Last time we looked at Super Mario Logan. I was not a little nice to him. We're not going to keep being not nice to him. Because welcome to another episode of YouTube Reviews. Today's episode, we're going to be looking at Planar Rock 124. Enjoy this video and let's get started. So you might be asking yourself, what is a Plain Rock 124? If you've been living under a rock and you don't know who this YouTuber is, or you're just not, or you're just not really part of any Nintendo or tech community, then here's this YouTuber. Plain Rock 124 started his YouTube channel back in January of 2015 and his second channel, and somewhere around April on his main channel. His YouTube channel getting over 1.35 million subscribers at the time of this recording, and his second channel only having six, only having around 6,000k subscribers. He makes videos where he destroys technology just like this. That's that's pretty burnt. That's pretty much a V card right there. And where he also does vi Nintendo videos, where he destroys Nintendo. T and that gets a V card right there. He also does hate comment videos, just like this. Up, you should be embarrassed about this. And he also makes high hate videos, but I'm not gonna be saying because that I don't take that much effort in my videos. The most well-known series he's meant for is a series known as Board Smashing which he made 92 videos of. The best, the funniest part is, he likes money, but that's his least most money-making series. Because here's his, here's his most popular video with 6 million views. Ooh. Here's his most popular 50 ways to break video, which is 25 ways to break, but who gives a shit? It's the exact same fucking thing, just a little bit less. And here you go. But, he, but his um, all the most popular shows is Moving On. I'm going to be using his um, newest Moving On video, and I'm not going to watch it this time. I watched it too many times. Here you go. Um, I'll just leave. I'll just leave. Ah! I knew this was going to happen! <laughs> and the part I used is silence it because it's epidemic sound up my ass. And yeah, so those are the most popular series. 50 Ways to Break gets him the most views. His movie on videos get him the second most views, and his least most view series board smashing gets him the most, I would say get him the most, like, overall time to work on other videos. His board movie smashing. Movie is selling out. The best part about playing Rock 1 before is that even though he sold out once, he's one of those YouTubers that doesn't like to sell out, which is a good thing. Here's him talking to Rick Chat Legends. Shit. Where's the telling pretty cancer. And here's him talking about um find any more. None of those were that trendy, I guess. Okay, one of his other shows would have to be how to flex a blank. Or basically, he'll make a video by him flexing either. His he only has three videos right now, and even though two of them how to flex your Apple card and how to flex your Tesla did really well, if that flex your Apple stand didn't do as well as I think he thought it would. But I mean that's okay. Here's one of his scenes from how to flex it. How to flex your apple stand. <laughs> Stupid Apple product that didn't support AirPods! Yeah. And he also has like another show that I forgot to talk about earlier. How to unbox. Basically, he'll take something and then unbox it the wrong way. Like this! And here's some of that footage. Another show she likes to do is called um a grocery store phones. Board smash grocery store phones. Here's one that doesn't have any kind of music in it. Good job, don't treat him. There you go. Good boy. Guess what? It's a vlog channel. 
I'm gonna stand back here just so you guys can, just so I can just put the thing on my feet here. Okay, so one of the things I like to do is Black Friday. Here it is. Yo, Chup. I actually kind of want to try this. Hey, Kobe, what do you think of my haul so far? Is another one would be him when he just does school vlogs, which I think we've all done school vlogs. Um, there's it. Another thing he likes to do is him just talking to the camera like a vlog usually does. With this, here's his My Expensive Mistakes episode 1, not part 2. I don't like that one. So I needed noise cancellation at the time! So I gave up my- That's his vlog channel. His vlog channel's not actually that bad, in my opinion. It gets a 5 out of- it gets an 8 out of 10. His worst thing he did was make a motto that it has to be something interesting. It can be interesting sometimes. Sometimes it's just him doing the same thing, talking to the camera for 10 hours, which I can't say that I don't like that. I do watch YouTubers that do that a lot, and um, it's really cool. The most popular Asian does that on the internet. The video was pretty short, but the editing is going to take a while. And this is getting uploaded um, in two days, so hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, Comment, like, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.